Today I'll be making some follow-up calls so you'll be watching me on the dialer. I've already made a few calls this morning so I will play that back for you guys and I'm just going to keep going. Um, it is now 5.50 in the afternoon so I'm going to do as many as I can and I've already sent I've already sent two written offers so we're just going to keep going and see if we can make it three and close the day up. Hello? Good afternoon. Hey, is Edward available? Um, he's not available at this time. May I take a message? Yeah, um, I believe I spoke with you before um, about his property in Greensboro. Uh -huh. Um, I just wanted to follow up to see if I could get in contact with him. Well, uh, actually, um, the the property is, is currently under contract. It's currently under contract? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Well, thank you so much. You're welcome. Mm -hmm. Hey, David. Yeah. Hey, this is Tiara. Um, you spoke with my partner, Jane, about your property in Raleigh? Okay. Did I catch you at a bad time? Uh, I'm just in a lot of pain right there. Okay. Um, uh, but yeah, but what was that, the top property? Okay. Um, yeah, I wanted to see if you were still interested in selling. Um, uh, uh, so that means you always looked at the property as to like a, you know, like what type of, um, Offer you be making? Yes, but um, what type what type of condition is it in um currently? I mean, I live here. So I mean, you know, it's not new, but I mean, it's in good condition. Mhm. Mm okay. Yeah. So we we be looking around, um, maybe in a two hundred range, like two twenty five. Yeah, sounds good. Um. Could you, what's a good time, well, let me see, because I, 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 I go, once my wife get here, and she, she's not going to get back until uh, probably about 5 o'clock. If you can call back then, because that sounds good, but I mean, you know, it would be both of us anyway talking, so that way we right. can have one conversation. Okay, Um, my son actually has an open house, he has school. So I, that wouldn't oh, wow. work for me today. But what I can do is, um, can I get your email? I can send you a written offer and call you tomorrow to follow okay. up. Yeah. Okay. What's your email? It's uh, mm -hmm. six seven at nc dot Okay, got it. And I hope you feel better. Uh, uh, <laughs> me too. I ain't going to say I can't get no words otherwise. I might be paralyzed. So I, won't, I won't say that. Yeah. <laughs> but I appreciate that. No problem. You have a good one. All right. Thank you. Bye. Hello? Hey, Deborah. Yeah. Hey, this is Tiara. You spoke with my partner, Nigel, a few days ago about your property in Greensboro. Oh, okay. Hang on one second. Get your foot in. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Did I catch you at a bad time? I'm sorry. Did I catch you at a bad time? No, no, no. It's it's okay. I just had to get him in the car. Okay. Are you a CNA? Um, I I do in-home private care. Okay. Sounds good. Yeah. <laughs> I just so, want to. Mm hmm. Uh, we had talked about the property. I have talked to so many people. Just refresh my memory. 
Okay, so yeah, he was telling me that you have a friend that is wanting to buy it, and I just wanted to follow up with you to see how it was going. Oh, 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 okay. See, that's what I mean. Um, well, I haven't heard back from them. They're talking to their bankers. I'm not real sure what's going on yet. I don't want to stress you because I'm trying to get a hold of them and see what's going on. Yeah, so we buy property all over North Carolina, and what we do is um, we buy property that's as is, or we buy um, homes that we can fix up. Uh, mm hmm So you want you want to rent you want it for rental property? Um, yes. Depending on the condition of the home and everything, then we can figure out what we want to do from there. But we are buying in this area, so um, that's yeah. Mm hmm. sure of like what our purpose would be for it yet but I do understand where you're coming from did you have a specific um price in mind that you were looking for oh yeah they're selling for 135 135 yeah the last one sold for 134.9 and another one sold for close to that um and actually what the condition is compared to, to her actually what who sold it and how much it sold for. And what kind of condition is it in currently? It's in good condition. It's in very good condition. It was my mother's. Um, okay. She took very good care of it. Okay. So, um, would it be okay if I just follow up with you maybe a week from now? You can. Absolutely. Absolutely. Okay. Sounds good. And I hope you have a great day. Thank you. Bye. Hey, Richard. Who's this? Hey, this is Tiara. You talked to my partner, Nigel, about your property in Greensboro? Yeah. How you doing? All right. That's good. I wanted to know if that property was still available. Well, he was supposed to, I don't know if he did or not. I hadn't checked, but he was supposed to send over another offer. Yeah, okay. And you say you wanted how much for it exactly? 125000 Okay, and is that price firm? Uh-huh. Okay, so um, you wouldn't take one twenty. dollars uh, If we could close within uh, 14 days? I wouldn't be ready to close in 14 days. Okay, how long would it would you be ready? Like how I, much time? I need to, my my real estate agent is out of town. Mm -hmm. Coming back into town this weekend, 
and I need to get with her and show her these offers. Okay. Okay. So you have more than one offer on the table? Yeah. Okay. And um, you said this weekend. She's coming into uh, town this it, weekend? It, it'll, be next, it'll be next week one day when I talk to her. Next week. Okay. Yeah. And, and you were you thinking about putting it on the market or how did you plan on doing it with the realtor? Or you well, just, I, mm -hmm. I, I need to talk to her. Right. Okay. So. I, I, I'm, a, I'm a mechanical engineer. I'm not into real estate. I don't know what I'm dealing with, so I need to talk to some professionals. Right. And does um, your real, realtor, does she have an email by chance? Uh, I, I don't want to give that out at this point, but okay. so let me. Let me, let me talk back to you one day next week, okay? Okay, that sounds good. Talk to you soon. All right, thank you. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Bye. This is Will. Hey, William. This is Tierra. I spoke with you the other day about your property in Greensboro. Yeah. How you doing? I'm doing well. That's good. Um, I just wanted to follow up with you. Um, I know you told me to give you a call back, so I was just returning, just following up with you about the property. You say you were still interested in selling? Yeah, my price that I'm selling for is like 70, 74000 So y'all probably don't want to buy at that price. Y'all looking for a deal. Is that correct? Well, we buy fix and flips or we'll buy properties that's already in 2021 um, standards. So what kind of condition is your property in? What? Can you hear me? I didn't quite hear you. I didn't quite hear you. What you say? Yeah, we buy two types of properties. Hello, Hello can you hear me? Hello? Well. Hey, can you hear me now? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay, good. Um, so, yeah, we buy a property that's already in 2021 standards, or we'll buy properties that need some work. So, what type of condition is your property in? Well, my property's in good condition. I got a renter in it right now. Okay. Hello? And how much do they pay monthly? Uh, seven forty. Seven forty. Is it a month to month, or are they on a lease? Uh, the lease is just expired. They want to renew the lease. I haven't renewed it yet. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, sounds good. And you said seventy four thousand. That's how much you want. Yep. And do they pay on time? Are they good? Tenants? Yeah, they've been there for how long they've been there? For about uh May was when they lease expired, so we just uh that's when I thought about selling it. So yeah, they've been there since last year. Okay. That sounds good. And do you have an email um that I can put in Yeah, this? my email my my Okay, and if this is something that we can do for you, I would like to just go over the numbers and, and stuff like that. But if this is something that we can do, um, I would like to send you a written offer to that email. Would that work? Yeah, just uh, yeah, go ahead because I'm getting ready to go into a meeting in about two minutes. So, yeah. Okay. Send it, send it to me and then I'll, uh, I'll respond. All right, All so right. sounds good. You have a good one. Mm -hmm. Bye. Mm -hmm. Hey, Terry. Hi. Hey, this is Tierra. I spoke with you a while ago about your property in Greensboro. Uh huh. How you doing? All right. That's good. Um, is that property still available? Yeah. Okay, and that's yeah, the. Yeah. Mm hmm. That's the one at nineteen seventeen Glenside. Uh huh. Okay. And um, you're currently living there, correct? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Is there were is there any particular reason you're looking to sell? Uh, well, we just want to get out the country. <laughs> I understand yeah. that. Okay. And what is your price range? Well, they sold some property around us 
and it's going to be a, probably about 150,000. Some go along in there. I will come down some. Uh, we just have one, two houses to sell right above us, and one went for 160, and the other one went for 140. And their land is like a a 90 foot across the front, but theirs goes straight back. And where mine is spread out uh, along the road, but it goes back to, I'm sitting right at, right close to two acres. And they can build uh, several houses on this property. Okay. And you said they sold right down the street from you? Yeah, they ain't, but uh, maybe three houses up. Okay, three houses. Yeah, three or four houses up. Both of them's on the, my house is on the left, from which way you come in. There are two houses uh, is on the right. And, you know. Uh, and do you know what kind of condition they were in? Well, I know one was a real, real old house, but they, they turned it into a church. And they went in there and turned it back into a house. Oh, wow. And I think, and that was, they, uh, their land is kind of like in a block. They got more, uh, not too much road frontage, but it goes in the woods. But, you know, you can't get back there to the other land, you know. Right. Okay. And how fast were you looking to um, sell? Well, you know, it's, I'm just, you know, a lot of people have been calling me on it, but, you know, that's uh, one boy I'm looking at his house, uh, and they re uh, they build in the house. And um, I'm going to say from here to the first of the year, you know. Uh, oh, you said the first of the year? Yeah. Okay, the first. From now to the first of the year. Some will look like yet, but yeah. You know. Okay, so you're looking for somewhere first to move? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Because I got a lot of junk and stuff we're trying to get rid of. We got to move. <laughs> right. And you're looking to stay in that area? Mm, I'm looking to get on out close to Reedsville or uh, up to Spokesdale somewhere, you know, mm -hmm. in between there. Probably out of different county, yeah. Okay. Out of the, out of the city. Mm-hmm. Okay. And we are partnered with realtors out as well. So um, uh -huh. I can have her give you a call if that's okay. To just... Yeah, it had to be in, be in the evening. I went back to work uh, part-time during the daytime. Okay. So probably around 5 yeah, well, about 5.30 or 6. 5.30 yeah. or 6. Yeah. Okay, and you said the price is um, a little flexible? Yeah. Okay. And can I have your email? Uh, what is her email? Let me let you talk to my wife. She knows all that. Okay. Hello. Hey, Miss Smith. How you doing? Doing good. That's good. Um, I asked him for his email address. Okay. Okay, sounds good. Thank you so much. Oh, you're welcome. You wanted him back? Um, yes, ma'am. Okay, I've got the email address, so um, I'll go ahead and run some numbers and see what I can do um, as far as price, and then I'll also refer you to our realtor who will be giving you a call as well. Okay. All right. All right. Sounds good. You have okay. a good one. Okay. All right. You too. All right. Bye. Right. So if you could just come up with some terms as well, that would be great. Um, we'll, when would be a good time to follow up with you? Um, maybe uh, Thursday around the same time, around 6.30 Thursday. Okay. Alrighty, sounds good. I hope you have a um, 
good day. Enjoy the rest of your evening. All right. All right. You do the same. Thanks so much. Thank you. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Mm -hmm. Wow. Hey, William. Yeah, hey, this is Tierra. I spoke with you a while ago about your property in Greensboro. Yes. Mm -hmm. Hey, how you doing? Oh, we're doing okay. We're, we're involved in another big issue here, but uh, uh, other than that, we're doing okay. Did I catch uh, you at a bad time? Uh, what's that? Did I catch you at a bad time? Is it okay to talk? Oh, no, no, I'm not doing anything right now, anyway, but, um, I, I think we're done on the other thing for the day, so. Okay, that's good. Um, yeah, I just wanted to follow uh, I, up with you. Yeah, I, I, I don't remember where we left off. Can you, um, bring me up to date on, on what we discussed last time? I don't have my notes with me right now. Okay. Yeah, you told me about your caregiver and how they... Stayed, I guess, an hour away from the property. Mm. How they want. Yeah, so, um, gave me a nice property description. And I wanted to know if you were still interested in selling. Well, it, it's not listed for sale. But we're, we're, we're taking offers on it. And, uh, we've had a couple of really good offers. And we're, we're considering it. So, it, it depends on how much money you're, you're willing to pay for um i think a, a, a you know one good offer will will tip the scales so um you, you know ha have you had a chance to drive by the property or look at it anyway or uh, yeah i drove by it when we first spoke it was about two months ago so it's been a um it's been a little while um did you know how much you wanted for the property okay if you provide me with your email address um it's my wife's email my, my computer hasn't been working for months okay so, uh, I, can, I can give you my wife's email if you, if you like okay i'm so, ready for it yeah it's it's And you're in Atlanta, correct? I'm sorry, what? Are you located, you're located in Atlanta? Yes, we're, we're living in Atlanta right now. And uh, that's one, one of the reasons we're hanging on. We've, had, we've hung on to this house in Greensboro for so long is that, um, it, it, that we're, we're considering moving up there um, and selling the house here in Atlanta. So, um, well, I'm not sure we're, we won't do that if it eventually. Oh. Hey, Stevie. Hey. Hey, this is Tierra. I spoke with you about two months ago about your property in High Point. You're not going to do it? Okay. Stay where we are. It's so expensive to move. We, we good where we are, but I appreciate it. Okay. Do you have any other properties? No, just this one. Okay. Got you. Well, thank you so much. You have a good one. Okay. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bye. Here, I spoke with you a few months ago about your property in High Point. Yeah. Hey, I just wanted to follow up with you and see if you um sold it already. Uh, we're getting 
getting ready to donate it to charity. Okay. All righty then. Well, thank you so much for taking my call. You have a good night. description and everything so I was just following up okay well I appreciate you following up all right have a good one bye okay. hey is this Raymond yeah. hey this is Tierra I spoke with you about two months ago about your property in Greensboro yeah, it's not too good. Oh, right now all right okay so I'll back in a couple, couple more months so all right okay thank you Uh, voicemail is on your answering machine. <laughs> okay, no problem. It stopped talking. Um, how are you doing? That's good. I spoke with you about two months ago about your property in High Point. Is it still available? Looking at houses that sold in that area. Your house is really nice. We we already came to see it. They're not selling that high. I don't see anything that's sold that high. But they are selling for around like 110. Does that sound something that like something we could do? To just do a few little updates to it so we don't want to buy it at you know our max and we can't fix it up to sell it or anything like that. Squeeze maybe um, you have an email? I'm going to make sure we have your email. So thank you all for watching. I will be uploading more videos now that I'm going to be on the phone more, which is also a good thing so you guys can see what I'm doing, how to make offers. I'm just a regular person like you. I'm no guru yet, so I am going to make some mistakes but it doesn't matter you don't have to be a pro at this just make just make the offer i mean just make it you know um so a lot of people have been asking about how to get into wholesaling and they want to learn and they want to start and there's a lot of videos out there where you can just jump and dive right into it and start but I do want to help you guys as well because I was the one, I was just like y'all watching everybody's videos and everybody's going to be telling you a different thing and I'm just another person. But I want to tell you guys what ways work for me, what wholesaling real estate is and how you can jump into it, jump into it with no money, jump into it with money, how to pull the best list because you, it does matter what type of list you pull. If you pull the wrong list, it doesn't matter who you call you're not gonna not gonna get anything so that matters as well you know before we go i have to give you all my affirmation of the day for you guys affirmation of the day is my family has generational wealth because of me see you guys in my next video